Navy Reserve Deep Submergence Unit reached new depths with a technology marvel called the Hard Suit 2000. The suit allows a diver to go to 2,000 feet beneath the surface and return without the hassle of a decompression period. The project has been in the works for over a decade and passed a major milestone by reaching 2,000 feet and achieving suit certification. We've done a substantial amount of testing up until now that's gone through pool dives. We've gone from there to unmanned dives. We went out with the suit in the launch and recovery system and sent them down to 2,000 feet. We went from there to pier dives. So each of these suits and launch and recovery systems have been dove by the pier and flown around to wring out any last bugs. So the only thing that uh, these suits will be seeing differently than they've seen in the past is a person being in the suit on the way to 2,000 feet. Commander Lenhart went on to say that he is very proud and happy to have been a part of this project. They put in the, you know, the 12, 16 hour days uh, all across the program. The first suit to achieve a manned submergence was piloted by Diver Chief Daniel Jackson. Jackson is one of seven divers in the world qualified to pilot a hard suit 2000. I feel like the luckiest guy in the world. It's pretty amazing. Right at 2,000 feet, topside turned the lights off for me, and it was like a star show. It's the best ride in the world right there. From Fleet Public Affairs Center Pacific, I'm Seaman Matthew Hepburn.